hello my better people you're welcome back guys today i'll be making a goosey soup yes another pattern of cooking a goosey soup please watch this video to the end so you see how i make my a goosey soup okay here is me giving you some dancing step okay so i just have uh, uh, put in the fish into my boy season meat so i put in some onions and my grounded pepper and little pepperoni for the soup to be reddish okay so i mixed it together guys and i put in my red oil yeah. so i cover it i allowed them to cook together then i brought out my goosey then i applied uh, i apply a little red oil yeah. then i mixed it together i stir it together guys my baby is just dancing around <laughs> me too i'm just golfing around okay Okay, yeah, I was saying it's not every day you eat you cook you eat fried goosey. It's not every day you cook fried goosey. Still try another method, just like the one I'm doing right now. <laughs> so I keep cutting in the goosey one after the other because I don't want it to be too smooth. I want it folding. Okay, so this pot was too small, so I had to change to another pot. Please, guys, please follow my page, guys. Follow my family page, the Imerion family. Okay, on YouTube as well. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. God bless you as you do so. Please share, like, comment. Okay, so I keep cutting it the goosey. So I turn it together. Make sure I stir it together so that the soup well it will not get burnt so after that i cover the soup then i keep stirring stirring and stirring so the next step now is for me to pour in my crayfish and i turn in my crayfish and i also brought out my uh, bitter leaf then i pour in my bitter leaf hey, hobby hobby loves bitter leaf oh my god i've never seen before so i turn in my bitter leaf then i cover it then later i open it again and stir because if i had stirred immediately the soup would be so bitter okay so i stir together i make sure it was stirred then I, I put in my salt and i add my maggi so i turn some water because the soup was too thick so you still need to be cooked please allow the soup to be cooked so that you don't run your stomach so here the soup is almost getting ready you can see the face of the soup it looks so yummy and delicious and the aroma it was everything guys if you have tried this method before drop your comments in the comment section thank you guys for watching see you in my next video